Hey everybody, how you doing? This is Robert Rivera with Who's On First, the show. And today, I'm gonna bring you some wacky stuff. See, I got my Savannah Banana hat on. And you know the Savannah Bananas, they do a lot of crazy stuff. We have Michael. He designs custom wiffle ball bats. So tell us about this uh, MK Customs. So basically, I really don't, I just buy wiffle ball bats. And then I like buy a bunch of like colors and of tape and like electrical and duct tape. First of all, I, I just wrap them and then I pull them up online. I look at the details and then just like try to handcraft it as best I can. Uh, this is a work in progress. The Savannah Bananas bat. Savannah, look at that. What I tell you guys? You can't beat the Savannah Bananas bat. <laughs> all right. All right. Is that all tape or what is that? Yes. Yes, it's all tape. Okay. All righty. I like it. I like it. What else you got there? So I got some personal bats that I use. I have the green Zen. Okay. All right. And and that you, you use the all tape with that, right? Electrical tape? Yes. Is that what you use? Okay. Yes. All right. And all then right. What, one of my other ones that I made that just like started getting me popular on TikTok was the WBC bat. WBC. Nice. Nice. I was there. That place was rocking in Miami. Woo, buddy. I heard great that. Stuff. What made you come up with this idea of taping them up and making them designs? Who came so up with I that? Just, I just saw the trend on TikTok and said just my wife's just jumping. Are you playing wiffle ball somewhere? You got like a little wiffle ball league going on? Well, I, no, that? not yet. I play with my friends sometimes. All right. So who gives you ideas? What gives you inspiration and stuff? Uh, Mainly MLW. They're just fun, like watching them and. Kind of maybe get into the game. Where So where did this love of uh, wiffle ball or baseball come from? Who introduced you to baseball? Well, baseball, I started when I was like, I think five or six. And I just loved it so much. So I just started playing the game. When I played um this like school tournament kind of thing where we play against other schools, MLW came into town to do like a tournament with like three age groups. And I saw them and someone asked me to see if I could play, but I couldn't. So then the next year came by, and I gathered a couple of my friends, and we played in it. So what? Explain to explain to everybody what MLW is. What is that? MLW is Major League Wiffle Ball. They have eight teams, four AL and four NL, and they have like a bunch of stars and rookies. So is that a goal of yours? You're going to be a star in the MLW? No, not really. <laughs> so who's your favorite team? Uh, I said the pers- yeah. the Pacific Predators. Okay. Oh, you're a minor league guy. You like minor leagues? Bruh. You go to school, right? You don't do this full-time. You don't make bats yeah. full-time. What's your favorite subject in school? Math. Okay. On your hat there, you got a, was it a CP, GP? Yes, it's my high school, College there? Park, that I'm going to next year. Okay. You'll be a freshman next year? Or you'll be, yes, uh, sir. Okay. Nice. What what position do you like to play? Shortstop. You're not the coach's kid, man. All the coaches can't play shortstop. That's not the coach's no. kid, right? <laughs> All right. So who's your favorite player out there? Probably, I'd say Bryce Harper. Who would you like to meet? Bryce Harper and Jeremy Pena. Wow, there you go. There's a there's a good one. The shortstop for the Houston Astros. Yep. All righty. When I played wiffle ball, right? Maybe Dad knows when uh, when the wiffle ball bat got a little soft. We used to cut the top off with a little saw, and then we would stuff newspapers, wet newspaper, in there. And give it a little weight, and then it's stiffen out. So th- there's a there's a little tidbit for you. The most ingenious thing I've seen is somebody use spray foam in the little hole on the bottom. Every wiffle ball has a little hole on the bottom. They sprayed spray foam in there, and they filled the cavity there. So that bat had a lot of pop to it. Now some leagues they don't allow it, just like corking your bat. They try to they try to cork the bat. All right, there, who's that dad over there? Yes. Yeah, Dad's over there. Yeah, Dad's over you, there. You, you know what you cause now? I'm going to end up going to buy spray foam. <laughs> <laughs> you know what's funny? It was in a tournament, and they wound up getting – they wound up winning the tournament, but they wound up getting thrown out, and it was because of the spray foam. And you know what? <laughs> Think about it. Years back when I played, when I was playing uh, wiffle ball, it would have been nice to have that little trick. But, yeah, it would have been – it would have been great to know. So, I mean, Dad – you introduced him to baseball? Yeah, I kind of introduced him to it. Um, he, okay. he loved the game from the beginning. Um, and I was never one to push him. It was always, 
up to him. If he wanted to play, he could play. And if he didn't want to, he didn't want to. So he works pretty hard at it. And, um, you know, the big thing is now trying to make the high school team here in the fall. So, um, you know, select ball is, is our family life at this point. Okay. All right. Little football bats. Are they I mean, for sale or? It, it depends on like what bat. Cause like some cost more for like, just like the tape, like the gold duct tape, the price has gone up. So I got to bring the prices up for those. And then some okay. of them just have more detail and they're like, take a little bit longer to make. So like a price range from like twenty five to thirty five dollars. Well, I see your math is doing really good. You you're a businessman right off the back. It's nice because ma math was one of my specialties. The parallel bars, my specialty. Ah yes, parallel. <laughs> but where where's can anybody get in contact with you guys if they want one of these nice little custom bat? Mainly <laughs> Facebook, and then I have a TikTok channel too. My TikToks MK's custom bats. What are you going to do with this, this little business you got, a wiffle ball bat? Where do you see MK Customs in five years? I don't know. Maybe popping. I don't know. Popping? <laughs> popping where? Where are we popping? Everywhere. Popping everywhere. All right. Can you guarantee a home run with one of them baseball bats? What do you think? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the wiffle ball league that you see, who's your, who's your favorite stars on there? Probably Alec Warda. Yeah. What team does he play for? The Pacific Predators. Ah, Pacific. Oh, so it wasn't minor league. It was wiffle ball. Wow, you really like yeah. that wiffle ball. Huh? We got to get you up one of those wiffle ball stadiums in your backyard. What do you think? No, it's too small. <laughs> not, not too small? Okay. All righty. Well, you know what? I also do baseball bats. I don't do wiffle ball bats, but I do I do bats also. So I, I paint and design my own bats and stuff. So maybe one day... Maybe one day we can collab, do a little collab. I'll let you have the idea, and we'll we'll let you do that. What are the other designs there? I know Dad only showed you only showed one or two bats. So what yes, other designs? Yes, I you have there? a couple of my other personal bats. I made the Victus Knox. Okay. All righty. And then wow. I made the the 2022 Voodoo One. <laughs> So what inspires you to make these? How do you get these designs in your head? Going on TikTok and just looking at all the other bats. And I just started like doing them, like the more popular bats, like the green Zen, which was like the most popular. And then I just started doing like bats that people just suggested. What's the most difficult thing about doing these bats? What's the hardest thing? Something that like you do and it drives you nuts and you're like, oh, I don't want to do this anymore. <laughs> it's mainly the details like some of them are really detailed yeah the little details in there the tape sometimes doesn't go on just it's just off by a little bit right sometimes yeah. you're like you know what i want to unravel that whole thing i don't like the way the <laughs> tape is on there yeah 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 that's i'm I, i'm with you i'm with you on that I, i'm really with you i do it all the time too what stadiums have you gone to i go to the minimade astros okay i gotta get over there what's your favorite thing about that stadium the train Every yeah. time they hit a home run, the train goes. Yeah. You'd like to play in that stadium one day? What do you think? Yeah. All right. Now we're talking high school ball now. You guys are going to be playing with some bigger guys, bigger, stronger guys. What do you think? You think you can handle? Yeah, I can play with the big boys. All right. I'm going to keep an eye on you. I'm going to keep track of you. Like I said, one more time, if somebody wants to reach out to you, how would they do that? You can go to Facebook or TikTok and like DM me or something like that. Okay. All right. So I'm going to post that underneath there. Is that all right with you, Dad? Yes. yes, that's fine. All right. That is fine with it. All right. Well, listen, Michael, I wish you good luck. I hope everything turns out for you and keep in touch with Dad there and see how you're doing. Okay. All right. Don't be letting me down now. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys. Well, thanks for the interview. I appreciate it. I love the wiffle ball bats. If you guys want a custom wiffle ball bat, MK Customs has got them for you. Keep swinging. If you like the show, please do me a favor. Subscribe, right? Right. You see it? It's right there. Subscribe, share, like, and don't forget, put that bell on. It'll ding you when I put something else on, all right?